welcome to another episode of The Sea Shop, where entertainment, business, and giving back meet to bring you the latest in celebrity news and info you won't hear anywhere else. Our celebrity guest is beautiful and talented, and she's become a household name. You may know her by the hit TV show, The Real Housewives of New Jersey. But today we're gonna to talk about some things that you may not know about her. So join me in welcoming Melissa Gorga. Hi, Melissa. How are you? Good, good. Now, I know you brought a lot of Twitter followers and Facebook followers with you. Yes. Would you like to give a shout out to them? Of course. Hi, my Twitter family. I love you all. Mwah. Thank you so much for all your support. Love you guys. <laughs> now, Melissa, I had mentioned that you're so talented. Tell me what your latest project is. Um, well, I just released a new single. It's Ooh. called I Just Wanna. Okay. And it's on iTunes now. Mm -hmm. And I just filmed my first music video ever oh, wow. for it, which I'm so excited about. How was that? So it was amazing. It was amazing. Mm -hmm. um, I collaborated with an old family friend that is mm -hmm. so talented. His name is Santino Noir. Oh. And um, he comes in on the track and he's amazing. Mm -hmm. And you know what? He's been on the stage since he's 14 years old. and. Yeah. I've known him as a longtime family friend, so we figured it would be so great to kind of collaborate. I wanted to give him the platform and the opportunity to, you know, show his talent and show yeah. the world what he can do. And mm -hmm. we wrote this song together, and it's, oh, wow. it's yes, it's amazing. That's it's a great, great song, so I'm excited about it. Now, I know that you also worked with Chris Judd. I did work with Chris Judd. He's so talented. He's so talented and so <laughs> cute, and he's yeah. amazing. He really is. He is such a perfection when it comes to teaching mm -hmm. and he's worked with I mean he was the right hand man of Michael Jackson yeah. so when you have someone like that working next to you mm -hmm. and showing you dance moves and he dances you know his style is so much like Michael who mm -hmm. I envy yeah so um, it was amazing it was mm -hmm. it was a surreal experience and he's he's great we still keep in touch and he's he's a great guy now has the singing come easier than the dancing or are they both um, naturally um, I don't know. I think they're, I, I'm more of a performer. I feel like yeah. it comes a little bit more natural to me. I love to mm -hmm. be on stage. I love to be in front of people. Mm -hmm. That comes uh, a little more natural to me. But at first it wasn't easy. And of mm -hmm. course, it's definitely not easy doing it all for your first time with the Bravo cameras on top of you. So oh, it gives yeah. it a little bit more pressure to know that, you know, you're not only doing this for the first time yourself, but the whole world. The whole world and is you have watching. millions of people judging right. you and criticizing you. And um, yeah. it's not easy, but I'm right. always up for a challenge. So, Well, I admire you because it's it's hard to have someone there all the time, seeing the good, the bad, maybe the ugly. Yes. It's not the finished beautiful product. It's not. Yeah. No, you don't always see the finished beautiful product. You see yeah. us with no makeup on and <laughs> you see us how when we wake up in the morning and if we have an argument with the family member or a husband or whatever it may be. So you know mm -hmm. what? We put it all out there. There, and I yeah. think that's um, why the show has been so successful. Mm -hmm. I think that um, it's very relatable. Yeah. So many people, you know, deal with family issues in their own homes, and mm -hmm. you know, they just really attach to us. They're very, yeah. it's very personable for a lot of people, mm -hmm. and um, I think that's what made the show so successful. Yeah. Successful. Well, because it's very authentic. It is authentic. It is. It is authentic. And I think, you know, when anything's about family, it just. It's the cream of the crop. So. Yeah. Now, did you find that sometimes you forgot that the cameras were there? Oh, yeah, you definitely yeah. forget. You remember for the first 10 minutes, and mm -hmm. then you kind of just, they purposely will, like, go in the corner and shoot you from oh, far really? away so that you forget they're even in the room because they don't want you to, you know, remember right. that they're there. So, um, yeah, you forget, and you just get used mm -hmm. to it. And, you know, I've always said from the very beginning, I'm going to be me. If I'm going to do this, I'm going to go on, and I'm going to be real, mm -hmm. and I'm going to be who I am. So that way I'm never chasing my tail. I'm never lying. Mm -hmm. I own up to everything I do. And I think that's why um, I found so much support from the viewers, because mm -hmm. they know when I talk, it's going to be real. If I yeah. did it, I'm going to own it. Yeah. And um, I, I put it all out there. So I think it's appreciated. Well, I'm so glad that you're on the show, because today we have some incredible items that we we can talk about and we have the CEO of Hidden Meeting Symbol that's going to be here, Dane Short. Wow. So would you like to introduce him so we can talk yes. about this really great necklace that he has? Yes, absolutely. Dane, come on out. Hi, Dane. How are you? Hello. Hi, how are you? Good to see nice you. Nice Good to see you. you. Good to see you as well. Thanks for having me on. Well, no I'm excited to talk about this because I've never seen anything like it. It's so creative. You can um, give this gift to someone and have the thoughts behind it, like your meaning behind it, and then they can also change the meaning as well. So tell me the story. How'd you come up with this? Right, so um, we have an entire line of jewelry based around this symbol right here, mm -hmm. which is the hidden meaning symbol. Pretty cool. 
Yeah, and it actually contains every letter of the alphabet and every number hidden within it. Get out of here. I can Does see that. Really? Look at that. Now, where's the F? Well, so let me tell you the story first. <laughs> I can see the F. Right it, was, it was actually a couple years ago, my lovely mother, Sally, was doodling, mm -hmm. and she wrote down the phrase, love is all you need, mm -hmm. but she stacked each letter on top of the next uh -huh. and then put a wow. peace sign on top. Wow, very oh, nice. Yeah. So it ended up creating this exact design, which she then sent off to be cast as just a love and peace pendant for herself to wear. Right. Yeah. But when the pendant came back, my sister and I were back visiting for the holidays mm -hmm. and she ended up taking it off at one point and we randomly saw it sitting on its side like this mm -hmm. and we noticed That's a K beautiful. popping out. Oh, look at that. See right the I see the K loud. In, I see yeah. it right there. I see the K. And since there's no K in the phrase, love is all you need, it got mm -hmm. us curious and motivated us as a family to see what else we could find. And at that yeah. point, we ended up sitting down and uncovering the entire alphabet, as well mm -hmm. as every number, all hidden within the doodle of her writing, love is all you need. Uh-huh. So, that is great. Yeah. Wow, so that is pretty creative. amazing. Completely that is pretty amazing. Uh, evolved organically. And what we mm -hmm. did is we ended up creating a line of jewelry around it where when you have it on, mm -hmm. it means anything that you want it to mean. Yeah. The one that I put on every morning means something very personal to me. Mm -hmm. But everybody here could be wearing the exact same symbol. Yeah. And would have a completely separate and unique meaning to them. Mm -hmm. So each one has its own meaning. Well, it's, so it's the exact same symbol that you see. But what happens is if you, when you're purchasing them as gifts, it comes with a card here. Mm -hmm. And then so inside of here, I have a two Melissa from Dane, uh -huh. and then I traced out her kids' names. Oh, oh neat! So cute. That's and adorable. Joy. I love that. So to her, she could be wearing the pendant, and uh -huh. it would have her kids' names. To and me, it would symbolize my children around my neck. Exactly, yeah. but it's the exact same symbol. It's the fact that it has every letter of the alphabet means mm -hmm. that whether that's a nine-year-old boy or a ninety-year-old grandma, whatever they want it to mean, mm -hmm. it, it means that's that. Pretty, that's, that's pretty. That is great. Cool. That's yeah, pretty cool. I like, like that a lot. Yeah. So for me, I use mine more as a tool to set different goals and intentions. So mm -hmm. when I put mine on it has my intention for the day so I kind of look at it and hold it and you know today it, it means gratitude I'm just yeah. thankful to be here with you guys and Aww. be able to work with my family and everything uh -huh. yeah, so I kind of use it as a as a as a guide whereas mm -hmm. some people have their kids names or really anything mm -hmm. so it gives you strength in a way you feel 100 percent. you yeah. feel like you have armor on when you're wearing that necklace right? exactly it, I, like I do that. and I like, like the like that. fact that it's unisex because it it's so hard sometimes to find gifts for people you're like okay well I would need to make sure it's the right size right. or the right this but this I mean you could buy like 20 of these and give these out as gifts and it fits everyone absolutely and it comes in pendants mm -hmm. bracelets necklaces earrings charms I'll oh, actually wow. show you one of our bracelets here Oh, that's um, great. Yeah, you put it on Very cool. around your wrist. Go ahead. I'll show you. <laughs> so you go on here and then you center it. Mm -hmm. You put it around and then you just tuck it in a few oh, times. Oh, I like oh, this one that. a lot. I like that a lot. Very and nice. You would tuck it two or three and then you got it on. Very you got a little nice. unique twist for your wrist there. Mm -hmm. Well, I like too that's a conversation piece. When people see it, they're like, is it a symbol or does it, you know? Right. Yeah. And one of the cool things is, um, you know, I did a little, I, I really knew nothing about symbols, but I did a little research and every symbol throughout history has always represented something, whether that's a Celtic symbol or a religious symbol or a peace sign. It represents something and tells you what it is, mm -hmm. whereas this symbol, you tell it. It's completely it. open mm -hmm. to interpretations and some days it might be empowering, some days it might not be. It completely depends on what you want it to Mm -hmm. To me, pretty interesting concept. I yeah. really do. I like how it's like personal. You know, Absolutely. you can personalize it, and I think it's great as a gift when people, mm -hmm. you know, when you want to give something that's not crazy expensive, but you want to act like you put a little thought into it. Right. Well, here you go. Exactly, because yeah. right? you're able to trace out that message. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, one of the cool things about giving it as a gift is we have a program, a one-for-one -one program that was inspired by Tom Shoes. And for every symbol that we sell, mm -hmm. um, I personally go into a children's hospital and gift out an acrylic pendant. We make them oh. an acrylic as well. Um, oh, I cool gift out an acrylic one. pendant so they're able to figure out, oh, this is all tied up. Well, you can see it right here. Yeah, we can see it. Um, they're able How to pick out their favorite that? color uh -huh. and then they get sheets of blank symbols and then they can then trace out different messages of faith, mm -hmm. hope, inspiration, yeah. their favorite superhero's name. It doesn't really matter. Whatever they want to yeah. do, something to take their mind off Mm -hmm. what Whatever. they're currently going through. Right. So not only Which is very nice. Yeah, not only are you able to to buy a personalized gift for somebody but then mm -hmm. on your behalf we'll also gift one. So that's been a platform that we've been 
extremely excited about. So you can feel good about giving it to someone and purchasing it because you're giving back. That's amazing. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and you know, it's just, it's, it's crazy how many stories have come back, the different testimonials. Um, mm -hmm. A couple weeks ago, as I always tell the story, we had a lady call in to uh, our 800 number crying. And oh. she just wanted to kind of talk to someone about the jewelry and I didn't really, I didn't really know what, what the problem was. I didn't uh -huh. know if we made her cry. Oh. Um, <laughs> and what had happened is she was going through a rough point in her life and mm -hmm. her friend had purchased her one and on the message had oh. traced out time heals. So oh. I guess for a couple months she put it on every day, time mm -hmm. heals, time heals. Um, Affirmation. Exactly. Yeah. And she ended up yeah. getting through whatever she was going through. And then for the last couple months, she had been using it as a goals and intentions piece and helping her move towards the future and mm -hmm. inspire her to keep on going on. Yeah. And she called in crying saying that she had just wanted to talk to someone and thank us. And she oh. had never had a uh, piece of jewelry change and evolve with mm -hmm. her life. Oh, wow. This is the same symbol that once helped her get through a rough times, now helping mm -hmm. her with the future. That must have made that's you amazing. smile. Probably more than smile, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's such a great feeling. That's amazing. Well, Dane, thank you so much for sharing all about this. Um, I'm excited. I, I love mine. Yeah. <laughs> and it goes with so many outfits, too. Yeah, right? it goes with everything. So thank you so much for joining us. We could talk to you all day. Hey, well, I appreciate that. <laughs> Lots of luck. Thank Beautiful. you so much for yes. having me on. You're welcome. Thank right. you. Thanks, guys. So, wow, isn't that you know what to get for people at Christmas no, time. It's it really, really easy. Is. Yeah, here you go, babe. He made our lives easier. <laughs> so now, speaking of charity work, which Dane mentioned, you are involved in charity work as well. Yes, 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 yes. Tell me about um, that. When I was seven years old, I had a coarctation of the aorta, which is a pretty large open heart surgery. Wow. Um, yes, and you know, I had it done at Deborah Heart and Lung, mm -hmm. where they accept every child, everyone, whether you have insurance or you don't, wow. um, which I think is so amazing. And mm -hmm. I, I was in that hospital for over a month, and it was a very stressful time in my life. I mean, a seven-year-old, I couldn't even imagine. I have a daughter that's seven, and if I had to see her with all of these tubes and laying <sighs> like that, um, it, I don't even know. It must have been so hard for my mother, and I do yeah. remember you know, tears in my mother's mm -hmm. eyes and my father standing by my bed and they slept in chairs every single night and would not mm -hmm. leave my side. And you know, my sisters were there and it mm -hmm. was just really, you know, a, an emotional time in my life and mm -hmm. I have healed that I, I, I now just get checked once a year just mm -hmm. to make sure everything's functioning and yeah. it all is, thank God. Um, but it really, I appreciate it to this day. I mean, mm -hmm. it could have, you know, those doctors were so amazing to me. So, um, yeah, that's that's yeah. where I give back to. Wow. That yeah, I'm amazing. actually going to be there at the end of the month. Um, we're doing like an, a, an American Idol for the children there, and I'm going to go oh. and judge for them. And How fun. Yeah, I really just think it's such an amazing hospital, and, yeah. you know, it touches me in some personal way. I like mm -hmm. to tie myself to something that really means something to me and that, yeah. you know, I have a little piece of. So, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. That's so cool. So, Melissa, isn't this fun? This we is have coffee fun. I love and jewelry. All these products. And you know oh, what I love even more? The ambition in everyone's eyes and oh, how everyone really is invested in their product and they really yes. want to. You know, they want to explain to you and, and it means mm -hmm. something to them. So that's the yeah. best part about it, right? I mean, how many of us have come up with uh, solutions to problems but never follow through? I mean, these are people that are passionate and have worked so hard so that we have solutions to everyday issues. Uh, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. I love that. I love this. And Entrepreneurs two, around here. You know, one thing <laughs> I really like is that you're so focused on being a housewife, which is so great because I think for a time in our society, people really focus on women being out of the home. But you're so proud of being home and having the kids and a family yes. and making that a priority. And I think that's why you have such a great following. Thank you. So tell Thank me you. about the future for you. So you have your music coming out. Um, is it a full album? Are you heading towards that? Um, you know what? We are heading that way. We mm -hmm. don't have everything laid out on the table yet. But mm -hmm. um, as of now, I, I have released four songs. Mm -hmm. um, two of them were in the top 10 on iTunes. Oh, that's um, great. Yeah, the one ballad that I wrote myself to my husband went to oh. number four on iTunes. And that's that beautiful. was huge for me. It was huge yeah. with just a platform of you know, me, my mm -hmm. Twitter followers, and my Facebook followers mm -hmm. have gotten that song into the top four on iTunes, which wow. for me was amazing. And that's why I love them so much because <laughs> they support me. And, 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 and it was with the platform of Bravo, and mm -hmm. I'm very grateful for that. Um, and now things are just, you know, they're getting better and better, and I'm mm -hmm. getting more opportunities. And there's more, you know, going on, and I'm tight-lipped about them right now, but there's things <laughs> I <understand>. coming. <laughs> well, Melissa, thank you so much for joining us and being on the C-Shop. Give one more shout-out to your Facebook fans, your Twitter followers? 
Thank you, everyone, for watching. Thank you for your support on everything. I love you guys. And to find out more great guests that we have in the future, follow us at C-Shop TV.